Gentlemen um, from Gate City and from Salem and some of us, we've been here 15 years now, and something happens every 15 years, apparently. The Democrat caucus gets together and they say, okay, let's invent an issue, and here's what we'll do. We'll invent it, we'll get on the House floor, and we'll say it over and over and over again, and then it'll become an issue. And every year, it's something like that. And this year, it must be that when you increase funding for education, it's a cut in education. Because that, it, it's been three or four days now that it's been the same speech over and over again. And, you know, I mean, look, it's obvious what you're all doing. I asked the uh, Appropriations Committee to give me a summary of state spending on education from 1997 until today, and then look at what is projected to be under our House House proposed budget. And you know what? It goes up. I'll leave this because it's not a big chart. I'll go put this by the photocopier so everybody can, uh, can get a copy of it. There it is. It goes up every single year. Every single year it goes up. Okay? So if it's going up, it's not a cut. And as many times as my friends on the other side of the aisle want to stand up and say that we're cutting education, we're not because it's going up. And as the gentleman from Newport News said, an increase is not a cut, and you can stand up on the House floor as many times as you want, and you can say it's a cut, but it isn't. It's an increase. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.